What is going on everyone? Welcome back. So you can see on screen that we have the Hennessy Venom F5 Coupe, uh, which is in Forza Horizon 5. Now this car you can get by winning a race or an event. I don't know exactly what one it is, um, but you can currently buy this car. It's fucking plastered all over the auction house. So yeah, go suss it out. It's in the auction house. You can buy it for a couple million credits. Um, this is the Venom F5 engine twin turbo V8, um, producing about 1800 horsepower, which is absolutely insane. Um, so for the, I've taken the the bonnet or the hood off. Um, if you press that, it will fade black and put get put back on just like that because there's no animation for it. Um, yeah, rear wheel drive. It is a very very long vehicle. Um, but as you can see, the interior is pretty basic, not gonna lie. It is just a bunch of screens and some buttons and whatnot. We'll just go in here real quick, just, just so I can show you guys. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, turn your bell notifications on. Um, but yeah, it's just a bunch of screens, some buttons, and literally uh, some floor mats, which looks like they're just tiles. Um, uh, the doors open, they're pretty sick the way the doors open. Um, we can turn the lights, it's not really making a difference. Um, but yeah guys, let's check it out. We're gonna, I think this car might be the fastest car in Horizon 5. As we know, it's always the Yesco. Connie Koning said Yesco. Um, that is a correct pronunciation. The only, um, the only, uh, performance upgrade you can get for this car is a race twin turbo with anti-lag, which, um, I, we're gonna put it on anyway. Um, even though I don't particularly like the, um, the sound of all of the pops and bangs it just gets a bit too much for me personally i don't know about you guys but um yeah i'll chuck the tune that i'm going to have for this vehicle in the description box down below we're going to go in eight speed we've got plenty of gears so we can get this car up to a decent speed tires obviously we're going to go drag tires for sure because this car is going to need drag tires um, we're going to put wide tires on the front because we're going to need as much turning or um, uh, uh, as much grip at the front that we can get for the wheels so we can turn at higher speeds. Other than that, there's really not too much to mod on this car, um, except we're definitely going to suss the performance, so the aero, just some fucking Forza aero, which no, we don't want to put on the car. Alright guys, uh, I think that's about it for this vehicle. Uh, we're just going to apply the upgrade, so we've just pretty much essentially reduce the weight of the vehicle that's i mean it's pretty disappointing but i mean 1800 horsepower car you really don't need any other fucking upgrades for this because this thing is got this is probably the most powerful car in horizon 5. all right so custom tuning for this vehicle we're going to lower the front and rear tire pressures all the way personally i'm just going to do this for um uh the, uh the grip that we can get from a reduced tire pressure um, first drive, we're going to extend this out quite a bit. Now, as you can see, you can see exactly what I'm doing and how I'm going to tune this vehicle and how you can tune vehicles in Horizon 5. Um, but yeah, we're going to extend these gear ratios quite a bit so we can get a bit more oomph out of the, uh, the engine of the vehicle. Or the gears, I should say. We can just extend them out quite a bit. Yep. There we go, that one. So seventh, yep. And then eighth is going to be all the way at the end. Alignment, I have reduced the rear camber to zero so we can get maximum grip on those rear tires as we do accelerate. Um, <clears throat> front and rear height, we're going to soften that up. Now springs, this is a bit of an iffy one. I'm going to lower it down all the way. So as we accelerate, the weight of the vehicle will be pushing to the rear giving us more traction at the rear as the weight's being pushed down at the rear of the vehicle where the drive is, if that makes sense. Rebound stiffness, we're gonna lower this down all the way as well. Bump stiffness, I usually leave it. Um, but differential, we're just gonna leave it for now. We're gonna suss out how it goes, but we're just gonna quickly paint this vehicle. Let's um, see what colors are available for this Venom F5. Now, I haven't seen the factory colors. I'd assume it'd just be some gloss colors from factory, and that's probably about it. And I am right. It's just a bunch of gloss colors from factory. It's, it's really not much. Oh, we have a matte black. That's pretty cool, matte black. Um, 
yeah, I guess we'll go. We'll go matte black. Um, the wing. We can go carbon. Ooh, yeah. Let's go carbon for the wing. Or is that a bit too much? <clears throat> um, we're gonna do it anyway. Wheels all black. Calipers. We're gonna obviously go red for these. Yep. A nice bright red. There we go. And window tint. We are gonna leave that. All right. So here we have it. The Hennessy Venom F5. Now it does sound pretty fucking sick. Can you hear those turbos fucking spawn up? And holy shit, this car is quick, like, far out. <laughs> I mean, the, um, the backfire is not too bad on this vehicle, but, um, but yeah, I mean, the, um, I'll just let it idle for a bit, and you can hear what it sounds like, it's pretty fucking mean. Go away, come on, seriously, driver tires, fuck off. Thank you. You can hear this car of, like idle, and it just sounds absolutely insane. You can hear the turbos spool up as well as you are revving up and down and going up and down when you're driving too, like in terms of the rev range, I mean, ah, that is, this is, you can see as you rev it, the whole car fucking shakes and moves. Um, now this car is... You can hear the turbos kind of spool up. Kind of hear it spool up very vaguely, like it's, it's, it's not. I don't know how. Like if you're, if you don't have headphones, I don't know if you can hear this, but you can definitely hear it spool up. <laughs> it's um, yeah, this car is fucking absolutely crazy. I think we're gonna get at least 500 km an hour, surely, at least. This would be the fastest car I've definitely made a video about for sure. Um, I think in first gear we're definitely going to get tons of fucking wheel spin. We'll do a launch. Um, yeah, we'll do a launch as we always do. Fucking hell, whoa. This, this car is fucking absolutely insane. Like, <laughs> I mean, it just I don't, it accelerates like nothing in Forza. I mean, this and the Yesco are the probably the two hardest accelerating cars in the game. We're gonna just pull off to the side so we don't get um, driver tires trying to fucking um, uh, like crash into us or whatever. But we're just gonna we're gonna do a launch and now I don't know how good this launch is actually gonna be because this car just has too much fucking power. Um, but we're gonna give it a go in the launch control. Um, Way too much fucking power. I can't even get grip on the fucking first gear to be honest. But whoa, Jesus Christ! All right, so we're already up to 400 k's in like 20 less than 20 seconds, about 10 seconds. Come on, come on, come on, Venom F5, you can do this. Whoa, come on, for fuck's sake. Alright, so we tried to rewind a little bit, but it didn't really work too well, but let's just keep going, let's keep giving it the bends, because it will fucking get up to what we need to, even in the rest of the highway here, I mean, this, this car is fucking absolutely insane. I mean, fucking hell, I... Come on. Come on. Come on. 500 kilometers an hour, come on! 487. Yeah, okay, alright. Alright, let's, uh, let's try that again. Alright, so we've made it back to the start of the highway. And um, we're going to try this again. Instead of doing a launch, we're just going to fucking give it the bands the whole way down and see if we can finally get 500 kilometers an hour. I don't know how um, how like how how well we're able to reach that speed. Oh come on, 80, 480, come on. Less than 20 k's to go. Come on. Come on, 87. Come on. Come on. Whoa, come on. Come on. Come on. 
490, come on! We're so close to 500Ks! This is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Oh, man. Let's hit 10 scoring for 500Ks now, even in the game. Far out. I mean, I'm kind of just blown away almost at the, just the sheer speed of this thing. Alright, so we do have a bit of rain now, so literally no point in even us doing a launch to be honest, but um, I have adjusted the tuning on this vehicle, um, so hopefully we should get a bit more speed up earlier on, if that makes sense. Uh, there we go, 4th gear, 400k, let's keep going, thank you. Alright, so we're up at 5th gear and 480 now. Come on. Come on, Horizon. Come on. Five. Oh, fuck, that was close, guys, in the bus. Holy shit. Oh. Alright, come on. Come on, you can do this, Hennessy. Come on, 482. We're going slower than we were before, but come on, I, I thought adjusting the tuning would help. Come on, for fuck's sake. Oh, I don't think it's going to reach 500k, but like 490 is pretty fucking impressive. Alright, let's try that again, guys. Let's, let, let's try that again and see if more tuning and adjustments will fix this. Alright, so I have adjusted the tuning again, and the gear ratios are absolutely massive. Like, it's it's crazy to think, to be honest. Third gear, 400Ks now. Let's see if this will do something. Oh, we're so close, 490, we're literally 10 kilometers an hour off. It's, it's fucking literally so fucking close, it's kind of annoying me now. Come on. Oh, that was close. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. 85, 6, 7. Come on. 8, 9, 9. Oh, 488. No. <sighs> Look guys, I don't think we're going to be able to make a 500 km an hour vehicle. Um, but yeah, go and check out this vehicle from the auction house. You can buy the vehicle for a couple of million dollars, uh, about six and a half or five about for, like, for buyout. Um, but plenty of vehicles going around here for sale. I mean, there's tons of them going for sale. I don't know where they all came from because when the game first kind of released up until maybe about six months ago, the vehicle you would not be able to find this at all in the auction house and now there's tons of them so go and snag one guys go try and make a 500 km an hour tune um, if you have comment the share code of the tune down below i'll put my share code in the description as well as the livery uh, share code in the description guys but guys thank you very much for watching and we'll catch you in the next one